Hello everyone, welcome to part 195 of Laravel e-commerce series and in this video uh, we will first of all going to see that uh, which point uh, we are going to do see this product reviews and rating point is already done we can uh, move it to the done points and next point is social share script okay so uh, the social share script we can integrate in the detail page this is the detail page of the website and we can integrate somewhere here like we have done in the basic e-commerce series along with that uh, we can also display left or right sidebar that will also look good so social share, uh, share script is really important nowadays uh, to add in every website so that uh, it will improve uh, the search results okay so like if someone want to share this product with some of the friends or relatives then that person can easily do uh, do share in his facebook profile or can share to his twitter facebook uh, uh, p interest and much more okay and and also uh, that person can able to email okay and whatsapp also okay so uh, that person can able to share that uh, uh, this page uh, okay uh, with any of his friend with any of the mode so that is really important nowadays to put in every e-commerce website and other website as well so we are going to integrate this and there are two websites available um, see these two are the uh, most uh, uh, see uh, uh, best website we can say one of the best websites add this and share this names are similar okay so uh, from these two websites we can able to integrate this script okay so first thing is we are required to make our account in these two websites and after that uh, we will add the script and we will make it online as well okay so uh, so let's see uh, let's uh, uh, make account in one of the website like add this and share this let's start with this share this okay so uh, i'm going to first of all try with the login and maybe i require to uh okay so see i'm going to make the new account okay log out and we'll sign up okay so i'm going to make new account uh see first of all it is asking to select okay i will select something like sticky share button to put it at the left side okay so i am going to choose this one and then we'll click on next and on the left side of the screen customize your we can also able to customize okay but first of all i will simply select this one and we'll click on next and we'll see here it is asking to make new account uh, so uh, i can also click on google or facebook okay so i will click on google I will try to log in uh, from my Google account. So stack developers to I can log in uh, with this stack developers to at the rate of gmail.com. Okay, official mail of this stack developer YouTube channel. So see, I have got the script now. So I will first of all uh, will try to copy this script offline. Okay, I will try offline. Uh, let's see if it will work offline. Otherwise, I will put it online as well. Okay, so it's in detail page uh so it is saying copy copy your head code okay it is saying head code but we will try here once okay we can move it anywhere but we will try here and uh this uh, uh paste your head code okay see it is clearly saying that don't paste it anywhere else it paste it in uh in head okay so we need to remove from here we will not paste here okay it is clearly telling us that where to place it uh, we need to place in front header uh, or or uh, there is one more file uh, front layout file and we are going to place it before head here it is okay so this is the place that uh, they are telling to place so we will place it exactly uh, the place where they are telling so uh, see this is the uh, another script that we need to put where uh, copy and paste this placement code wherever you like your inline share button to appear on your website okay so it is asking to put in the page where we want the script to be okay so uh, we can put this uh, and we will 
put here maybe i i'm not uh, i don't know that what this script will do uh, we have selected that sidebar option but it is uh, asking me to put let's put let's see what will happen i have put it like this let's see i am going to refresh the page now and uh, let's see where the script has come or not no it not seems to be come anywhere it is not coming at all so uh, so we will check once uh, copy and paste this placement code wherever you like your inline share buttons uh, to appear on your side okay uh, so right now uh, i will do copy continue to dashboard so let's see what will maybe we are required to make it online okay uh, see it is asking us to add the domain so i am expecting this thing to happen so i am going to open my domain where i am going to place this script this is the stack developers dot in where we are uploading everything right from the first day okay so here uh, we will uh, open the detail page as well and uh, this script uh, see uh, the, here i am going to put stack develop uh, please enter the domain which you okay so i am going to put my domain name here stack developers dot in okay add new domain uh, we are unable to verify stack developer protein please ensure this uh, okay so they are asking to uh, add the script there so we are going to open this one here resources we are going to update this page here sourcing views front see we need to update two pages we need to update detail page and also we are required to update front layout page okay so i will try if it will move like this okay i am not sure that it will able to we able to move it like this or not let us try uh, okay here it is come uh, no it is not moving like this okay let's see now it is doing okay i have replaced the detail bed file we can check here okay it has been replaced so one more file is required to replace layouts front layout and that file is this one i can replace this file as well front layout file and we are going to replace this file as well okay so let's try to refresh now uh first uh, let's refresh it that the script come here or not uh yeah it has come but it has come down you can see at the bottom it is it appear at the bottom okay so uh, here also we are going to refresh we need to make changes in our script okay so here i am going to click on this thing customize your share button and we are going to check why it is uh showing like this uh, this is the tool so we are going to check once again uh, see i can do one thing i can uh, put uh, the that detail this one uh, this script uh, maybe we are required to update the script and put it somewhere else okay so uh, we can uh, see check once again website activate code copy activate activation successful you can see uh, code is code activated see it is coming like code activated refresh once again that uh, we have not make any changes so far okay so here customize your share button uh, left right okay we can write minimum count show total count large call option mobile breakpoint vertical alignment undefined pixel uh, height on mobile corners update please allow about five minutes they are saying uh, 
let's see no still uh, I think uh, okay let us try the another script okay so I am going there uh, inline share buttons inline share buttons okay let's try with the inline share button this one okay so there is the another script this one is the another script here i'm going to copy this code and uh, going to place it here okay, so let's try with this one now uh, okay detail i'm going to the now detail blade file See, it do take some time because uh, we need to experiment okay after a long time I'm working on this one and this one I have uh, see this one okay now it is looking better okay so you can see it looks really good okay so we can replace this one okay we will also try with the left uh, that uh, uh, that script uh, okay that is coming on the left but this one looks great uh, so we can customize this one as well here see we can select the icons that we want okay uh, so like I don't want Pinterest okay uh, I don't want Twitter I want Facebook uh, I want uh, WhatsApp WhatsApp uh, this is messenger I think oh yeah Facebook is also important this is uh, I think this one okay Facebook is already there so we can uh, not require this one so uh, okay so email is important email is already there SMS share and uh, other than this one WhatsApp WhatsApp is important I am I am looking for this one so we can move it first yeah now it is looking fine Facebook uh, WhatsApp okay so Facebook and WhatsApp are really important Twitter is also important we can put Twitter as well Facebook Twitter uh, WhatsApp email and uh, other than this one this I don't know about this one uh, we can simply remove this one Fair now see uh, now it looks better and share is having the other options email person can email as well so now it looks good uh, now uh, see I'm going to click on update let's see that if it will automatically update okay I am not sure that it will automatically update if it automatically updates then it's really good for you okay you no need to make any changes in your code just you are required to make changes in the website itself let's see wow what uh, see uh, changes are appear here okay you can see the Facebook Twitter and WhatsApp okay email and share other option is also there all the options are coming when you will click on this option and see I am going to share now like uh, if I will click on Facebook here it will ask you to log in into your account okay like my account is already logged in so it is directly showing uh, see the shirt is also coming here with the details simply you need to click on post to Facebook if you want to share this one in your Facebook account okay and like in the same way uh, when you will click on this tweet uh, it will share in your Twitter account and it will show in your WhatsApp account when you will click on this icon okay and if you want to email someone then you can click here to email that person uh, and like uh, this one if you want to use some other like if you want to uh, use Gmail or you want to use some other platform to share uh, this page then you can easily do that okay all the social uh, links will be uh, are here okay so uh, this one is working fine let's see left sidebar once again okay uh, so let's once again try that uh, uh, sticky share button this one okay so let's see if it will work this time uh, this is the tool that we want to apply uh, customize your share button that is fine and um, only thing that we want to put uh, some script there okay so that script we want to see that where to add that script okay so right now see uh, that uh, share uh, is not coming at the left or right sidebar okay you can see uh, but uh, uh, we're going to try um, here 
left right then okay update see this one uh, we have already put i think in the front layout page let's see once uh, this is the screen uh, script that we have added sticky share buttons that is fine property 6125 let us copy this one and we are going to check that this is exactly same okay this is not required to update okay so this one is same uh, solution guide See, it do take some time. Uh, I am going to open this one in Chrome browser because here it is not opening properly. See, uh, when you will do something like this, uh, okay, so like I am doing right now, uh, uh, so sometimes these things do take time, so you not have to impatient, you need to keep doing. Okay, I logged in into my account from another browser and here we can see that both are enabled sticky share button and inline share button inline share button we have already added sticky share button we need to see uh, see it is uh, showing in the same way we are unable to verify it's enabled uh, now uh, customize your share button uh, script okay so maybe the script is having is some issue in mac operating system or maybe in safari or chrome okay so uh, we can still uh so first check it add spacing vertical right okay we can check another account okay another information Okay, let's open. Let's try once. I have not done anything, uh, but maybe the script will appear in detail page. This one is coming, but that script is still not coming.
see uh, it was earlier uh, displaying at the bottom of the screen rather than at the side like on the desktop side uh, for you the ability to have the share button in web and mobile however if you prefer to have the web version please follow these steps uh, go to the sticky share button product page uh, go down the customization section and scroll to breakdown enter number zero click update and scroll to breakdown enter number zero breakpoint enter number zero uh, i'm not sure okay so we need to leave this uh, we can uh, also try with the add this okay so one script is working from here like i have shown you but another one is not working so we can try uh, there is the another website and that is the add this.com okay that's why there are two websites and we can try here if we can able to uh, add uh, the script from here okay so uh, i'm going to to see which view is not looking fine okay so these are the third party uh, okay so i don't know that i'll get started uh, okay so they have very dirty form i don't know why okay no issue uh, or sign up with google facebook twitter okay i am going uh, with google once again uh, okay, stack developers account. Let's see if uh, okay. So let's see stack developers to admin of gmail.com. And I am from India, so I will uh, add here India. Okay, register. So uh, now uh, share button, follow button, share button. Uh, so here it comes okay so uh, let's try with this one in line we have already added uh, so activate tool so they have uh, just given us the code and asked us that we have to place this code uh, paste this code uh, closing body tag before the body tag okay so this code we are going to place before the body tag okay uh, so let's see uh, first of all uh, i can try with the detail page and i will put this at the end here okay it's it's before the body definitely so let's see if uh, uh, it will work fine uh, i can do it like this okay so let's replace and now check if it is working yeah now it is working fine okay so one script is from the share this and one is from the add this to serve our purpose okay so here also we can uh, customize this one okay so it is working fine even uh, yeah i have made the account there okay so that is uh, you need to make your account in both okay uh, so uh, now uh, here it is uh, here it is okay uh, so this one i have added but we can uh, even customize this one so i can simply go back and uh, i can use selector by you okay so uh, from this one uh, we can select our uh okay whatever we want we can select okay uh so i'm going to select the few ones like uh, facebook uh, or uh, facebook is fine twitter is fine p interest we are going to remove uh, rest all are fine add more services here we can add whatsapp as well okay so whatsapp is also there we can move whatsapp uh, at the third position facebook twitter whatsapp email and at this now it seems to be fine activate tool okay so uh, now see uh, now we are going to check uh, whether uh, it's working 
and i think i i am not required to uh, refresh the uh, page oh, okay not required to upload the page okay uh, let's see the changes appear yes uh, no uh, see whatsapp still not coming uh, so uh, maybe i required to make some changes with the code uh, so uh, first of all i will uh, close share this this is we are working with the add this this time so we can put this code once again in the detail page itself uh, click the code to copy mm, right to your clipboard okay so here we can check once okay so let's see it seems to be same i think Hmm. So once again, we are going my side here. Uh, it is displaying everything. Okay. So tools. Uh, we want to integrate floating tool. Floating two. Okay. So this one is the floating two setting. Uh, this is the tool, uh, and we can update it once again, and we'll go here in setting once again and see the options here it will take some time to understand these okay i am also doing first time with you okay i have no experience in this one and okay, individual okay so this one we have already added and uh, but i want to uh, so it is fine but i want here the script uh, okay so this one edit is taking us back okay uh, so we just want the script where is the script target rules okay uh, these are the target tools these are the email list okay website tools tools we can do one thing we can remove this uh, see uh, this one also we can update let's uh, try with this one this one is already added so okay so let's see once uh, that it will work fine or not i'm going to refresh here in chrome itself okay see now it is working fine i have updated the another tool that i have earlier added see now uh, both are having the same option what is coming from the uh, share this and what is coming from the add this from here as well you can able to click this one and you can able to share wherever you, you want okay uh, you can check here as well uh, see you can refresh and here the correct options are coming and you can able to share uh, any of your page okay uh, simply by clicking here here you can see the same uh, information is coming and you can just post to facebook okay so like this you can able to add uh, this option in your website uh, so that your website can be shared in other platforms as well it will also improve your seo search engine optimization uh, your website ranking will increase and also uh, uh, it will become uh, it can become famous okay uh, so uh, try this one at your end and if you will face any issue you can surely contact me okay then uh, that's all for now have a nice time goodbye